I'm Corey Duke. Here are your top stories from Two Works For You. A man is being treated at the hospital after police say he crashed an SUV into a school. The Chevy Suburban hit the side of McKinley Elementary near King and North Sheridan overnight. It appears the vehicle took the brunt of the damage. Police say the driver ran away and our overnight photographer was headed to the scene when he actually spotted the man and called 911. Officers tell us the man will be booked into jail after he's released from the hospital. And as we get closer to the FEMA deadline to apply for disaster assistance at the end of the month, many recovery centers are cutting back their hours. Starting today, the centers in Muskogee, Tulsa, Wagner, Creek, and Payne counties will only be open Monday through Friday from 8 to 6 and on Saturdays from 10 until 3. Local law enforcement will be out this weekend to catch drunk drivers. To help people get home safely, the state's NDUI program is giving out $10 Uber coupons. Just visit NDUIOK.com to request one. Across green country, DUI checkpoints will start tonight and run through Sunday morning. Now let's get a check of today's forecast for meteorologist Kerrigan Chauvin. And we're seeing mostly clear skies this morning. Temperatures in those upper 70s, a mild and muggy start to your Friday. As we go into the afternoon, temperatures in those 90s. We are going to have to look out for a 20% chance of showers and storms as we go into the later portions of your afternoon and into your early evening hours for today. Forecasted highs all throughout the area going to be in those um, 90s, lower 90s for the Stillwater, Bristow, and Tulsa area, upper 80s for Bartlesville and Coffeeville for today. A little bit warmer off toward Oklahoma City at 93. Seven day forecast showing those lower 90s lasting throughout the weekend with the chance for showers and storms increasing for both Saturday and Sunday. As we go into next week, things are going to be warming up a lot. We are looking at temperatures rising into not only the mid but upper 90s as we go throughout Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Corey. Thanks for tuning in to this digital news update. Keep checking back for updates throughout the day. I'm Corey Duke, two works for you.